Just let them know who we with and where you from, man. All right, man. I'm King Corn Truck, man. All right, Bell Glade 561 3340. What's up, y'all, boy? Y'all already know, being a neighborhood hero. Y'all know, man, but this one I'm from, man. I'm from right here, man. 725 Southwest Avenue Beach. Part man A, man. Born and raised. You made me everything who I am. You feel me? I love my city. I'm right. still here, man. I, I, can, I can come here. I can chill. You know, some people get too big for their city. The city still love me. I take this shit on my back. Hmm. Is it true that you were raised in South Bay? I'm from South Bay. I was born in South Bay, so. Right. I was born in South Bay. I stayed out of Marshall Heights in the project. I moved to Bell Glade in the second grade. Correct. You feel me? So, I ain't really been down there since I left, but them boys still love a nigga. I learned a whole lot down there in the Bay, you feel me? Because the Bay different from over here. Like, hmm. you feel me? The Bay. They more like family. Still to this day, it's, vote, it's vultures over here in Belgrade, bro. You really got to be built for this shit. Mm. In the Bay, bro, you get a whole different vibe, family vibe. You know what I mean? Your mama. It, people know your kin folks over here, but the Bay is even more connected. You feel me? Right. It's just like, the, even to this day, when you think about it, be like, this side Bay niggas, them boys still together. This shit right here, cousins beefing with each other. It's a little different, but it's still love in the G, you feel me? What other people went through, I don't go through the same things, you know what I mean? God right. bless me different. I can go where I want to go. I can go to Side Bay, Bell Glade, Pahokee, stand on any corner, any block. You know, it's out of love with me, though. But I'm still around here, tell you know. Got my hmm. car wash right here, you know what I mean? I grew up right here, but I didn't really want to leave the corner. Right. I leave the spot. I'm comfortable around here. So I got corn truck. Why people call you corn truck? Going to a family name, my dad named me that. Hmm. Crazy thing, I got two dads. Buddy my buddy my, my stepdad, you feel me? Right. Yeah, but you know, step don't mean nothing, but you know, he stepped up. That's it. He made me everything. I'm grateful, bro, you feel me? Right. My mom already had six kids. She had six boys. Before he came, we got a little brother from him, who my mom, they married now. Anyways, they call him Kingfish, but my mom, she she cashed in her 401k early. Bought my dad some my trucks, corn trucks. So as he started building them or whatever, I just stuck with him or whatever. He was like, I'm gonna build you an empire. He we went from one to four, four to 12. We got like 20 of them building out. He just called me the king of corn trucks, like it's mine. Right. And to say that, like, you feel me? Because like I say, he got his own son, but when. When he named the company, made it an LLC, I knew it was real because he named it Jenkins and Sons with an S. Like, you feel me? He only got one biological son, but by him pinning the S on it, it's just like I knew, you feel me? It was for us, you feel me? He was for real, for real about this shit. Right. Yeah, yeah. We talking about a lot of things, my hustling way. So, you not only a comedian, you make music too, though. Yeah, man. I'm, a, I'm an artist. And we got a few right. lyrics right here, man. And yeah. it and it goes, that's what my mama told me. Don't let no one control me. That's what my mama told me. Don't let no one control me. You be a man in the pain, grab your nuts and holes. No matter. You remember that? Yeah. You be a man in the pain, grab your nuts and holes. Mama, I got saved. Mama, mama was 12. But she had to be, bro, the six, six boys. By herself, she had to be tough on us, bro. She always taught us to be a leader, be the head and not the tail, mm -hmm. the lender and not the borrower. You feel me? Right. Yeah, man. Just, you know, having faith in God, you know what I mean? You can do all this, you feel me? Believing in yourself, you know. My mama was the one who gave us, like, self affirmation, like, you a king, you a star. You feel me? You, she'll tell you, like, you're not doing this for nothing. You ain't doing this for nothing. You going to school, you getting these good grades. You ain't doing this for nothing. And then she used to tell us to be proud of what we did. Hmm. You feel me? You accomplished something. You made the honor roll, son. Be proud of that. And you walk around with your hand. You tell people, I made the honor roll. You know why? Because I ain't, you ain't do this for nothing. I did this so that I get this goddamn certificate so that I can say I made the honor roll. You feel me? Right. Yeah, you, you ain't doing nothing for nothing, bro. Because nothing from nothing leaves nothing. You got to be doing something, bro. Doing nothing, you'll get in up falling for anything. Now you gotta stand for something. Back to where you was talking about.